Hey, 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 and welcome to Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. And as you can see, you guys, I have put up the beautiful tea set for us to chat. And today's video is all about how we have created articulation and some of our dolls. And we've got some fashions that we definitely want to show. Oh, my goodness. I almost fell and broke a heel here. My stand didn't want to work, but I'm back. Okay, so let me introduce some of the dolls that will be looking at some of the fashions that we're going to be viewing today okay and first we have our articulated beautiful doll that came in the set i don't know if you all remember her she came in a set of colored um they were regular articulated five point articulated dolls and um they all had different colored dresses on and shoes and i believe she was the one in yellow I don't remember what that set was called, but she has on a lovely and gorgeous um, outfit from the Fresh Dolls. This is a jean dress with an orange shirt. I paired it with a pair of really cute orange heels. She looks absolutely amazing and she's gonna be looking at our curvy girls that will be showcasing some of these outfits that we're gonna see today if they can, um, because some of these outfits are older um barbie outfits and i don't know if they were able to let some of our curvier dolls but she will be our commentator when it comes down to the curvy side of things okay next we have our beautiful co-host that usually co-hosts with us but we want to show you this really cute sheer jumper that she is wearing the sheer jumper is sheer the pants are like a sheer this comes from um i believe they are called the sky um, I gotta remember the name of this um, company, but I kid you not, we have all have had them. They came from Walmart and they are called the Sparkle Girls. I had to look in the case, but they are the Sparkle Girls. They look absolutely phenomenal. This outfit was $1.95. I paired it with a gold headband from our um, fashion accessories that we were getting from Zuri. And I gave her just a pair of black shoes with the silver top of it. The outfit is absolutely gorgeous. And I think she looks absolutely amazing. Co-host, come have a seat. Okay, last we have our next guest host with us is our other Barbie. And she's the Barbie that came from the, I believe it was the reboot, correct? And she's the one that had on the nighty clothes. And we've given her a great articulated made-to-move body. And she is wearing this um, really cute... Uh, jean dress kind of with some heels to match the blue in it she's this dress also came from um, the star girl so this is one of the outfits that came on the star girls so if you have any star girl clothing know that they can fit your made to move dolls and I think this is so cute because it is a gives you kind of like that corset look um, and it looks really good on her so let's go ahead and get the ladies down and let's start the show okay 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 it is time now to show you guys a couple of dolls that I've created and I'm probably going to use these dolls to um, sew some of the fashion packs that I received um, for Barbie that I wanted to give you guys a good look see at and now that we have our girls sitting down at the table having a strong sip of tea let's go ahead and get started with some of the dolls that I created to be made to move and the body types that I use for them the first things first is all you all know the Delphi Lucy dolls are big. I showed you guys before that this is one of the dolls that I did collect. Um, but this time, instead of that body, as you can see, she's got a little oddy oddy with some, what is that? Articulation. She is on um, one of the Integrity doll bodies. Yes, and she is a perfect skin tone match, as you can see. She looks amazing. She's got a full little rack up here too, you know what I'm saying? So she's going to be giving a lot of the body for the girls she's got that articulated leg now she looks absolutely amazing and this is the fr um brown or dark fr not dark sorry the african-american color so i wanted to this doll because she's got such a beautiful face structure i really wanted to give her more of that um integrity style body on her I, she could definitely do and be matched, as you can see, with um, the African-American tone. Probably yellow top Barbie. But I absolutely loved her with this beautiful body of integrity. So she'll be helping to model us today. She's now articulated. Yep. 
All right, our next doll that we have that is articulated. If you guys remember, I did a video maybe last month, I think it was, where we did our first deep dive into um, the Barbie um, color reveal dolls. I actually have another one that I have to do a unboxing for, so we'll do that a little bit later. I have like three other ones actually. Another different set though. But I had two of one of my favorite dolls, two of my dolls that were my favorites and I want to share with you guys um, how I was able to give them articulated bodies. So the first one was the doll that had the blue hair, Barbie with her, with her beautiful blue tresses in it. Um, and this is the soccer doll is the one that I paired her with. So she's going to be a little taller because that soccer made to move doll is a little bit taller, but she looks amazing. Okay, the skin tone is not like a hundred percent a match, but you really cannot tell. Like you'd have to be really up there looking really hard to see if she um, can tell. But she has an articulated body now, and I cannot wait to redress her. I think she looks absolutely fabulous. Our next doll that was in that series was also the other one, which was Teresa. I think she's more Teresa inspired. There she is. She looks great. And she has our Teresa doll with the green top body. And she is a great match for that. She looks phenomenal. I found this really cute Barbie shirt and it matched with these shorts. So I thought that was cute. So I could kind of keep her outfit together. She's got her same boots on, but now she's got some movement and she said she's absolutely ready to get dressed. I love this doll. She's like one of my absolute favorites. Our next dolls come from um, Bratz. You guys know I am a lover now of Bratz now that I can put them on <laughs> an articulated body. I feel like they look better. So here we have our gorgeous Jade. I found Jade for $11 at um, Ross and her, she has a skin tone match with the purple top doll, okay? I think she's cute. I can't wait to redo her hair, give her a new outfit as well. But she just looks amazing with the made to move body. I think they they gave these dolls made to move bodies or really great bodies with articulation. There would not be a problem at all. I think these they look great with full bodies and not little heads and little bodies and you know what Brad does. But I love her lips. That's Jade. Okay, and the last two dolls that we have that I have made articulated recently are our Disney dolls. So I like to buy the Disney version of the princess dolls because their face sculpture is very beautiful. Their hair is gorgeous um, to work with and they really pair up quite nicely with our, our dolls. So the first one that I have um, is from Frozen. Doesn't she look gorgeous? I love Anna. Anna looks amazing. She's gonna have a new outfit pretty soon. Yes, she does. This um, doll, I paired her with the purple top. Okay, so she's another purple top doll. If I'm gonna bring her in a little closer, you can see there is a little variation of color, but not that much. So, but she looks absolutely phenomenal. And when you're dressing her, um, these, and I, what I like is that th these are the original clothes that they came with and they can even still wear the shoes. The whole entire outfit is completely wonderfully made for our made to move bodies. So here we have Anna. And lastly, we have beautiful and gorgeous Mulan. I have wanted Mulan for so long. She also is the purple top doll. And while her skin tone is not 100% there, she does match, okay? She looks gorgeous. And I just wanted that face sculpt when I got ready to do a Milan doll. So I'm super, super happy that I got Milan. And I'm ready to really redress these dolls. And I'm thinking with these dolls, the Disney ones, maybe I can find the outfits from the IOY since they do fit them and see it, how they look in their character outfits. I think that'll be super, super cute. Okay, you guys. So those are the dolls that I have put together to go ahead and start our fashion show. So please... Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and come back and watch part two of this video where we're going to show you all the fashions packs that I received and I ordered from Barbie with our new articulated dolls 
showing you exactly how it looks. Now, because these are older pack skies, don't forget that this might not work on our curvy dolls, but we'll try our hand at a couple of things. Thank you guys so much for entertaining and our reveal of our new articulated dolls. And thank you guys for coming in and having a little spot of tea with us today on the doll table. You guys have an amazing day. Don't forget to comment. And I'm glad to be back and starting these videos back up again because I've been on a little hiatus. So this video is kind of short, just a little introduction to show you a couple of dolls that I had an opportunity to rebody. And now our next video, we're back to the races. We're showing some fashion, so don't forget to tune in. Thank you guys for having a great day, and thank you again for Brooklyn's Barbie Bay. Bye, guys.